Do you recall the glory days of VHS? I do. I'm Rob Scallon. And I'm Tamara Lynn. From, from Chicago, Chicago, Illinois. Illinois. Let's, Let's talk, talk about, about that. that. Good mythical morning. Sorry, guys, Link is not here this morning. Last minute, he got a callback for an audition that he did for NCIS as a lab tech. Apparently, his audition went really well. He got a callback, so I think he's going to get the part, and I'm going to be doing the episode solo today. April Fool! April Fool! I'm here! I was under the table! <laughs> gotcha! Uh, that was exhilarating, Link. Well, it's not even April Fool's. That was yesterday. I so. know, but we don't do a show on Sunday, so we had to do April Fool's on April 2nd. But we still didn't get ya! <laughs> you couldn't see the top of my head, could you? I hope not. Uh, it really would have ruined it if, yeah. we, if you had been able to. Yeah, this episode is brought to you by the YouTube Collection on DVD. You may have seen the product launch yesterday. YouTube's making big news. They are releasing all of their videos, even new ones as they're being created. On DVD, they can be delivered to your home if you sign up on the website. And you may have seen the promo video yesterday because we were in it. But did you know that we also wrote and directed the video? Fill out the comment form and place it in one of the self-addressed stamped envelopes. Don't forget to throw in a green thumbs up or a red thumbs down. YouTube approached us and asked us to make the video to promote the YouTube collection. But all this interaction with DVDs, we started talking about just the transition from VHS to DVD and this kind of thing, and it got us thinking about. Well, even before DVD, the, the, the transition from DVD to the internet video was kind of like the transition from VHS to DVDs. But there was a time before VHS. Yeah, the transition from nothing to VHS. I, I remember, you know, back when I was a kid, when we were kids, you had some options for entertainment, and they were pretty much, you could watch television at your home, or you could go to a movie theater to watch a movie. And then one day, my dad said, hey guys, we can do this thing where we can watch a movie in the house. No stinking way. I was like, whoa. It's whoa, called say, a- Slow down, say that again. We can watch a movie in, in the, the house? house? It's a thing called a VCR. Now, at first, you know, you you didn't purchase a VCR because they cost too much money. You would actually go to the video store and rent the VCR. And we went to the our families went to the same video store, Coates Family Video, which was the only video store that I knew of in Harnett County, or at least the closest one to us. Right. There wasn't one in Lillington, even though Coates was smaller. You would go to Coates. They got one first. You would go to Coates, and you would. Dad would get. He would. And first of all, he would go by himself. I remember. The first couple of years, he would just go off by himself because it was like, I'm not going to mess with having to get everybody's input. I'm just going to go and I'm going to get whatever they got. So he would come back mm -hmm. with a huge box that had a huge VCR in it. Mm -hmm. and, then it and then he would have the tapes. And the tapes came in these very, very large plastic sleeves. Oh, yeah. Um, well, well, I'll go ahead and show you guys. I know some of you, this is already blowing your minds. Now, let me show you. This is a VHS tape. Wow. It actually has magnetified tape in it that spins on two wheels. That is incredible. And this one happens to be Mr. T's Be Somebody, which is uh, just so happens to be the most amazing VHS tape in the history of VHS tapes. It's like 60 minutes of inspirational Mr. T power. If you need to pick me up and Good Mythical Morning is not doing it for you, watch Mr. T's Be Somebody. Hey you, you with the teeth. Come here, come over here. That's better. Now I can see you. You know me? Of course you do. That's because I'm famous. You can be famous. But we would go, Dad would bring back the huge VCR and a couple of videos. And then, a couple of years later, he let us go with him to the mm -hmm. store. And, and by this time, you probably had purchased the VCR. We had purchased the VCR. Like two or three years into the process, he was like, I'm going all out. I'm getting a VCR. And then it was like mind blowing because it was at any time we wanted to go to the video store, get a video, we could put it in there, we could watch it. Well, it was a whole, there was a whole outing associated with it. You know, going to the VCR store and the VHS rental place became an adventure and entertainment in and of itself. Oh, yeah. And I remember you go in there and they'd have the shelves and at Coates Family Video, it was like all homemade. The guy had made everything himself, all the shelves, but the VHS tapes were sent to him. He did not make those. He did not. But there would be only one. Even new releases, there will be one of them. One. 
So it would it would be I remember you know Batman with Michael Keaton would come out on VHS and you'd want that thing. And you, I remember, you call, you call ahead because there was one copy, yeah, and yeah. you could keep it it's for like, seven days. The Jenkins have it. Uh, it'll be in it on Monday, right? And they would, they would say that. They would say, "Well, you wait three days, and then you can get it." Well, and the funny thing is, is I remember the day that we went to Coates Family Video, and they had two copies of a few movies. And I was like, "Dad, look, they have two copies. This must be a really popular flick. Let's rent both of them. <laughs> just, just so we can still say that we're the only people in like a three county radius well, you know we that's watching done. Batman. We should have rented both of them. And then we should have sub rented to the Jenkins for cheaper. Right. Well, no, for cheaper, that wouldn't have worked. <laughs> no, you'd rent it. For, for more. <laughs> I, was, I was with you. I was like, right, yeah. <laughs> we're, we're thinking with our like first grade brains that we actually Let's watched. give the Jenkins a deal. <laughs> <laughs> the first one's free. Well, I, but I think what you would gain is you would gain power. There's like power being brokered here. Oh, I'm giving you a deal, but you owe me. <laughs> Sub rent for less. Yeah. What a business model. That's why we're internet comedians and we don't have some thriving business. Home video business, which I'm sure we would have loved to That's do That's why we're in a small room with a card table speaking with you every <laughs> okay. I, re I remember that the Disney... VHS tapes, they you know they always tried to outdo everybody, so their tape boxes would be Big. bigger, oh, yeah. and they would be white and really puffy. I remember that the cases themselves would be puffy, like if a kid would try, spike it like a football, like vinyl, would, and yeah, kind of yeah. It's like it had like some kind of patent leather kind of a sensation to it. But then the world changed because Blockbuster came along, and Coates Family Video. Hung on. Started going downhill. I mean, they hung on for years. And yeah. we would still go, just out, almost just out of spite. You know, we would go, and we would go in there, we would get the the, the one of two copies of Rocky Five, and we would watch it, we would enjoy it. And then, I, yeah, and then I would go down the street to, my mom would always go rent the video, and then we'd walk down the street to Coke's Party Beverage, mm. which was a convenience store where they didn't sell gas, and but and they didn't rent videos either. But they 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 sold party beverages, which we didn't purchase any of those. That's like alcohol or beer. I'm just now realizing what a party beverage is. Right. I yeah. never knew what Coates party beverage was. I just thought it was just like a place. Well, I just thought it was a place you go after you rent a video, you have a party. It's like I'm going to have a party and, and get a beverage. <laughs> I'm gonna get a Ce celebrate. I'm gonna get a beverage, but not a party beverage. Celebrate that we got the only copy of Batman. I would get the foot long hot dogs. So even to this day, whenever I see a VHS tape. I, t I taste a hot dog. You crave a hot dog. I, no, I actually taste it. It's like, hmm. A uh, more pickle, uh, more relish, I think, this year. Yeah, how about it, Jimmy? You see, you should use your temper and not lose it. <laughs> Take a salad, Jimmy. <laughs> Anger. Use it. But don't lose it. And now we're coming to the end of another era, because uh, Blockbuster itself is shutting down everywhere. You know, j just right down the road here in Sherman Oaks, they've got the big sign that says, on the Blockbuster, it says, going out of business, or this location closed, yeah, this location only. Just this location. Yeah, right. Every Blockbuster everywhere is going out of business. Why, why would they put up that? It, you might as well just put up the sign. All Blockbusters are going out of business. Do you still rent videos from Blockbuster? Now, here's what you're saying. I can read your comments right now. You're saying Netflix or Redbox. R Redbox is still a powerhouse. I don't know how it's happened, but- Redbox you, is, temp is very temporary. But yeah, it's, it's a short time span. People are gonna be talking, do you remember this Redbox outside of the grocery store? It was like a, it was like a, like a convenience machine, you know, like a vending machine, and it had d DVDs in it. Yeah, I'm serious. Do you use the Redbox ever? I haven't used it since I've been in California, but yeah, I, I used to use it because I, with Netflix, at least, what, what I have, you've got the videos that you want right then that you don't have, they don't put them on disc, but mm -hmm. you want it right now, you're willing to pay for it. They only put it on disc. They only put saying. it on disc. And so you have to wait for it. I'm like, I want to watch this movie right now. It's the movie I just thought of. I'm going to go to the Red Box and get it. And so that's why they need to get past the whole disc thing. And it just needs to be, if you want to watch a movie, you should be able to pay to watch it. Instantly, well, that movie. But hold on, that's why Amazon is, and that's what I, I don't do. Redbox, I do Amazon. I pay four dollars, right. which is it's not Redbox is a dollar. I pay four times that 
just to sit down and click and there it is right there. But it always works and it works better than Netflix. I've been using it a lot to the Google TV. It I costs a lot more. Amazon. If Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but you can rent our documentary, I'm just thinking of this, Looking for Ms. Locklear. For $2. On Amazon. So if you want to watch that, you can search your Amazon. You can search Redbox, but you won't find it. And you can also go to Coates Family Video, but you're just going to find some dude who set up weights in a pool table. And I think that like he has his friends over. It's not, think, a, it's not a video store anymore, is what you're saying. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm saying, man. I'm saying it's not a video store anymore. Do you recall when you used to rent VCRs? Are you that old? Are you as old as we are? I hope not. All right, let's end this episode. I pity the fool who didn't watch all the way through this episode because they're about to miss what's going to happen right now. You've been getting a lot of these lately, Link. Link falls asleep. Why don't you be Mr. T? And I'm gonna fall asleep. Now I apologize for for Link. He has a condition called narcolepsy, which means that at any moment he can fall asleep. What do you mean? I don't even know what. It it just happens sporadically. It's a condition that he's dealing with. This is, listen, don't laugh. This is not funny. This what is are they laughing thing. about? I mean, I mean, a lot of people. There's nothing to laugh. A lot at. of people deal with this. What are you talking about? Her? It's not a laughing matter. I mean, this is a real condition that a lot of people have. There's like conventions and there's treatments that you can go and you can get into a serious accident. I mean, what if he was driving and this happened? I'm serious. What? What? I'm serious too. I haven't been sleeping. What was I doing? I was nothing. I was talking. That's all I was. Do not laugh at him. That would be exploiting him because of a condition that he cannot control. You people. What? Watch what Mr. Was that? T. Hey, don't break that. Don't break. This I'll is... see you tomorrow. Well, Link will be here too. You gonna be here? Uh, see, this isn't really inconvenient. My first VCR.